Hey guys, this is Versatile from VST Power and I host some Project Phoenix Media. In today's video game tutorial, I'm going to show you how simple it is to host a game and also join other gamers for Borderlands, the pre-sequel, using a Tunkle program. Yes, this game works with Steam. Yes, this game works in real land. And yes, this game works with virtual land, which we're going to showcase in today's tutorial using Tungle. So here I am in the Tungle client. I'm going to type in the word Borderlands in the left-hand side here. Under network search, click on forward a couple times here, and here we see that Borderlands, the pre-sequel, there's a lot of different networks, and we got 240 gamers out of 255 right now. So that should be a lot of good times for finding other gamers, or host your own game too for other people to join you as well. So I'm going to let it load a little bit here. Once we're inside the network, just one thing to note, if you ever get confused about what to do with this game in terms of updating or troubleshooting, whatever, click on the Don't Panic button. There's a list here of how to play instructions and also how to change your name and other useful things as well. So bottom line is install the game, update the game to the latest version, join the Tungle network if you want to. Tungle is not required, but that's definitely an option. Once you're inside the network here, go ahead, start your game, and then join someone's game or host your own game, and other people can join you and have a lot of good times. So with that said, let's jump straight into the gameplay footage tutorial. Let's do this. All right, here we are at the main menu of Borderlands, the pre-sequel. So let's do this. So how do you host a game and join a game? First thing you want to do is press the N key, and let's go to LAN, because that's what this method is going to be showcasing today. So we got LAN already pre-selected, and I'm just going to do continue and continue my campaign. My game will automatically show on the main browser list, and on, of course, I also port forward in my Tungle, which is UDP 11155. So let's go ahead, just run around a bit, just a little bit. I can't guarantee that someone's going to join my game this very instant during this video game recording, but at least you guys have an idea of how to host a game. It's pretty simple, and if you guys have issues with hosting a game, let me know, and I'll give you some tips in the YouTube comments as well. So that's how you host a game. I don't see anybody joining the game right now, but granted, there are tons and tons of games in the lobby list right now, so I'm not surprised if someone's not going to join this game since I am sort of new, level one, and there's other gamers at much, much higher levels than I am, which is fine. So let's go ahead and press escape. Let's go back to quit here. Let's go back to the main menu. And what I'm going to do is, once we're at the main menu here, let's go to Find Games. And let's see, Searching for Games, and let's see what's out there. Booyah, look at that. We got a lot of different games here. That's awesome. I'm going to join, um, let's go ahead and join this one, for example, here. And there you go. Joining someone's game. Pick your character. Have a lot of good times. So let's go ahead, click on Play. I only got one character right now. And now uh, let's do this. Press the T key, say, or press the Y key, say, let's do this, or whatever you want to say. And there you go. And you already have a lot of good times there. So that is today's video game tutorial. You guys have any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on YouTube page. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.